Welcome to Electricity and Magnetism, Part 7C, Ammeters and Voltmeters. In this part, we're going to look at where ammeters and voltmeters are placed in a circuit. Now, ammeters, as you can see in your screen, are placed in series in a circuit. A little example, here's an ammeter placed in series. Electrons leave the power supply, go, flow through the ammeter, a couple resistors, and go back to the power supply. And because there's only one path or leg in this particular circuit, you can see that the uh, amps or current will be everywhere equal inside this circuit. Ammeter resistance is very low, so they use have a very small voltage drop. We use a very little voltage as the current passes through them. You want that so it doesn't interfere with the functioning of the circuit. Voltmeters, on the other hand, are placed in parallel in the circuit, and voltmeters have a very high resistance, so they draw very little current. And here's an example of a voltmeter in a circuit. So power supply, current leaves, flows through the first resistor, comes to here, and very little current goes through this voltmeter because the resistance is so high, and the majority, vast majority, like 99.9%, .9 flows through this resistor because when resistance is are in parallel, the electrons flow to the lowest resistance. So if this is a huge resistance and this uh, resistance and this is small, the majority of the electrons, or almost all of them, will go through here and the current passes through. Okay, I hope that helped. Please feel free to leave a comment.